Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, and welcome to another video of the Diamond Trader. My name is Daniel, and today, guys, we're going to do an update uh, on three stocks that I'm buying this week. Uh, two of the stocks I already have in my portfolio, so it's just a case of averaging, uh, averaging in. Uh, if uh, you haven't got these stocks, I could consider these stocks at the moment as the prices that they are uh, quite well priced, quite cheap. And the third one is a stock that uh, I do not have, I will be buying. Uh, and uh, a lot of people have been talking about it on you you've probably seen it on YouTube I know a lot of people that have this stock and I'm um, looking at the price this week uh, and I've always said that if I get into this company it will be below $20 and it just so happens that they're just below $20 uh, at the time of recording so so yeah let's get into it the first one you can see is on the screen uh, it's a giveaway and that's Curiosity Stream now Curiosity Stream is uh, I consider has been the next Netflix for the future uh, in the sense that it's a, a platform, a streaming platform that has a variety of uh, documentaries. Okay, so it's for the specified, it's specific to, to that niche market. So it's quite a niche market. Um, and uh, I think it has a lot of future, has a lot of future. Uh, the CEO is the guy that actually put uh, this discovery together back in the day so he has a lot of experience knows where he's going um, it's a stock that to be honest with you it's going to be, take a while to get there it's going to take a while to get there having said that it's one of these stocks that you need to just sit and hold on for it for a while so it's a long-term stock it's not a short-term stock by all means and with these sort of type of industries this the streaming industry it enticed people to get get on and register to subscribe she would say uh, you have to really have a low price and that's what they have they have a real real low subscription and uh, i can't remember what the price is to be honest with you but uh, if you have a look i'll leave the link in the description of a, a video i've already done a review on this company uh, and an in-depth review so uh, i'll leave that in the description uh, for you to uh, watch that um so yeah i think this is a great one to be looking at for the future i mean if we have a look at the their future growth uh, it's looking quite promising so we're looking at uh, having a profit being profit around about 2023 which is which is quite promising and as you can see revenue this is how they expect revenue to uh, to grow uh, over the next uh, few years if you look at them compared to the rest of the market their growth should be quite exponential we, well, that's what we're hoping um so yeah they have some good content out there uh, and it's a it's a it's a good company i really like this company so the price is at the moment, let's have a look, the price is at $13.22. Uh, so the ticker symbol CURI, it's on the uh, NASDAQ. And yeah, prices in February, like most, were hit up the highs, so just from below $23. And then it's come down now to this price, which we're 42% down from the old time highs. Uh, I think this price is actually quite reasonable. This is quite a reasonable price for the long, uh, for the re near future 22 23 dollars so that would be sort of the price target so yeah so you're looking at just just nearly under half the price so 46 percent of the price at the moment so uh, so i consider this one as a an, as an exciting one so yeah like i said i'll leave the link in the description so you can have a look at the review on that one now the second one is uh, drone delivery canada corporation ticker symbol t-a-k-o-f a uh, high uh, volatile and very risky one now this is the drone industry the drone industry is pretty much like um the ev industry in the sense that there's a lot of players out there and it's very hard to predict who's going to come out on top okay so um and, and the drone industry by all means is no different so I'm sort of looking at the companies. I've been looking at companies, looking to see how do other companies differentiate themselves from the others. Okay, so this company to me uh, is quite a complete company. Uh, it's at cheap prices. I actually bought pretty high at them. Uh, actually, I think I bought around about one sixty-five, one dollar sixty-five. So yeah, we're down at one dollar twenty-one. The sense it's on uh, on the OTC market, so um, it's considered a penny stock really. Uh, and yeah, I'm looking at this because this company has uh, their their own drones. They have their own logistics. They have their own software. They have a full package, a real quite complete package. And they're actually working with one of the airlines, uh, Air Canada. So they already have 
a, uh, a, a client. Um, and again, this is a risky one, and this is another one to be holding on to. Uh, we need to keep an eye on how to see uh, the revenue, what was interested as revenue. There's very, very little revenue, if any, at the moment. So we, we want to keep an eye and see that they manage to capture more of them, more and more uh, in the next, at least next year or so. But I consider this one as a good one. And again, I've, I'll leave the link in the description. I've already done a review on this company in the past. So uh, you can watch that uh, in-depth review. Okay. And in fact, I'll probably do an update uh, sooner or later on this company. I haven't done an update for a while. Now, the third one is this one. There's Tattooed Chef. Under $20. And uh, it's on the NASDAQ. And the ticker symbol is TTCF. This is a company that a lot of people have talked about and I've said that I would never get in unless it's an, until it gets around about under $20 and it has done. Well, in, back in March, we did get to these levels at 19. I didn't consider getting in. Um, but now that I've managed to uh, reubicate, so I say, my, my cash flow, my cash into the stocks that I have, I've now got some spare cash that I'd probably like to buy uh, um, into a, a new company i usually use my cash on on the side to average into companies instead of buying new companies when i when i see companies that are half on my watch list and i've wanted to buy them for a while i sort of try to take advantage and now just just seems the advantage to be taken uh, to be buying this company so this company is a plant-based company plant-based company makes ready-made uh, food uh, and they have good results they have a great future and uh, i'll probably do a review on this very soon uh, like i said there are a lot of people out there have done reviews on this one uh, a lot of uh, people i know but um yeah i think this is a company that has a lot of future and uh, i'll uh, yeah watch out for the review I'll, I'll be doing a review on this one soon so those are the three stocks that i'm buying this week uh, I think they're well priced. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you have Tattoo Chef? Do you have uh, Drone Delivery Canada? Do you have Curiosity Stream? Let me know in the comments down below. And let me know your average. Well, I like to hear people's averages. Uh, don't ask me why, but I just love to hear people's averages. So, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. That really helps the channel grow. And hit that like button. That like button really helps the YouTube algorithm. Guys, thank you very much for watching. And I'll speak to you soon. Take care now. Peace.